contest is scheduled for one fall with a 15 minute time limit. Introducing first from Chroma City, New York, this is Apollo Stone. Apollo Stone, 250 pounds. Apollo Stone already with the one match advantage over Jose Valdez. But we are in a different world. This is BWA. This is Battle for the Beast. And his opponent from East New York, weighing in at 210 pounds. This is Martina de Guerra, Jose Valdez. He's living in that 21st century. Jose Valdez lost one of the biggest matches of his career to Apollo Stone, but now we are on BWA turf, BWA territory. It is one on one. There is no Dexter Reed. It's official. Jose Valdez, the machine of war. Apollo Stone, he's the machine of the Platinum District. BWA Battle for the Beast. Will it be the last of BWA in the foreseeable future? Now, a lot of shade being thrown by Apollo Stone. A lot of shade being thrown at Jose Valdez. But I bet you that's not going to get in Jose Valdez's mind, of course, coming from the upbringing that he's had. A street fighter from the mean streets of East New York. Starting off the way he likes to. Valdez likes to show how much more athletic he is than he looks. He is not a stereotype. He is not a statistic. He is the war machine. Car and elbow tie up. You're going to see both of these men display their attributes in this match with Apollo Stone at strength, with Jose Valdez at his speed and technical prowess. The raw brute strength of Apollo Stone and the Chaos Theory German is what felled Valdez last time we saw these two competitors. And of course, again, you have to give a hand to Dexter Reed. Locking up one more time. A test of strength here, jockeying for position, a car and elbow tie-up. Side headlock by Stone. Stone will have the advantage when he squeezes the life out of Jose Valdez. You hear just the crack of Jose Valdez's jaw. Apollo Stone does whatever he wants to do, whenever he wants to do it, when the game is power. But when the game is submission, then it is not for Jose Valdez who stood there like he was going to knock down Stone, and Apollo Stone bowled him over. Jose Valdez needs to wrestle his match, not Apollo Stone's match. Valdez now. Valdez getting a little hype. They say you're not really in the match until you take that first fall. And with this being one fall to a finish, how many falls are either one of these men willing to take? And there we go, tripping out the leg. Jose Valdez is trying to block Stone there. Boom! And just stomping away. And that's where the street fighting comes into play. They got a count of five to get out of the corner. And Apollo Stone, no shade being thrown, but it's sounding like a bit of a woman. And Jose Valdez, he showed how he froze those hands. This commentator's going, how does she? You want to trip to the doctor? Hey, she got these things in man up. A lot of trash talking. And they'll reset in the middle. And where this match began, still the feeling out portion of this matchup. A process is feeling out an opponent. Even though these two are no strangers, they met in gang rules. They met in NGW. Nice take over there, waist lock. And Apollo Stone. Apollo Stone trying to roll with it. And Valdez rolls, but he rolls to his back. Valdez now. Notice. He's keeping Apollo Stone at an arm's length. And there we go, shoulders are down. Move! And an elbow right to the face. Wait, Anaconda Vice! Anaconda Vice! Stone now! Stone trying to get to the bottom rope and does. And Valdez immediately relinquishes the hold. And you might ask, why did he do that? Well, it's hard to hold on to 
a man as strong as Apollo Stone ripping and tearing, trying to get free. And Apollo Stone sure as hell got free. <laughs> I wonder if that's a quiet confidence by Jose Valdez or if he really is playing cautious with Apollo Stone. Oof! Stiff jab there. And now Stone throwing the hands. Apollo Stone! Apollo Stone is beating him down! Oh, 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 oh! Seemingly 40 or 50 shots there! Only in the count of four! And a shot right to the jaw. Apollo Stone is like no other, and he hasn't even broken out any of the suplexes. Oh! Where, where have I seen that before? Can you Stone singing a little bit of a cappella there. Oh! And so, oh my God! Ref's got to count a little faster. Count you out. Stone's doing whatever he wants. And Valdez now, Back Valdez. Up. Looks like he's just been in a gang fight. I know next week is gang rules. Stone now. Irish whip. Oh, Valdez! Stern him first to the buckle. And look at Apollo Stone who shot him out of a cannon and he, oh, he's happy with his work. Oh. Drove an elbow, Apollo Stone now. Hooks that far like one, two, yo, oh, so close. That was a long two count. Work to the advantage of Jose Valdez. Wait, another one, two, and Stone with those huge arms locking him up. When Stone locks those hands, ain't nobody getting out of there. Oh, now you, now you really hear him talk trash. I'm not going to repeat what Apollo Stone just said there. I, I, I've, heard a, I've heard several food chants here, with potatoes and T-bone steak. Making me a bit hungry. Oh! Beautiful vertical throws him out of the corner. Apollo Stone now, going back to that cover. Referee in great position and new. Count of two only. Jose Valdez at his wit's end, but still kicking out of everything that Apollo Stone has. I think that's key to getting ahead of Apollo Stone, especially putting all his weight and locking up the leg on that cover. Had to be sure that he was gonna get him. Apollo Stone now, where's he going? Apollo Stone on the comeback. Oh no, oh, counter, counter the Star Destroyer into the spine buster, Jose Valdez. Was he playing possum? Let's find out. Woohoo! Driving by with a message. Jose Valdez. Unreal. Apollo Stone, I thought he had him. But Valdez now, just like that. Back on the offense. Oh, a little classic. Oh! Cannonball Buster. Two. No! Valdez. Valdez looked like he just dropped out of the back of an airplane and landed on Apollo Stone. Holy shit. How did that not get a three? I tell you, this is nothing like their match that they had at NGW backed by popular demand, and it is nothing like gang rules. This is as competitive as I've seen these two. One might say gang rules was one-sided. One might say in the other direction was backed by popular demand. But both of these men are delivering everything they have for one another. Oh, Stone onto the buckle. Valdez coming in. Oh, Gallup line. Oh, man. And Valdez took a seat. Woo! Valdez is impressing himself. Oh, forearm uppercut. Apollo Stone reaching deep down. Coming back with a forearm uppercut. Cutting off, cutting off a very, a very confident Jose Valdez. And Apollo Stone, he ain't playing no more. Look at Valdez, oh my God, he's dead. <laughs> Apollo Stone now. Apollo Stone looking to set something up. Oh, forearm uppercut again. And after the first one, his jaw has to be numb. Oh! Valdez. 
Doesn't even look like he knows where he is. Oh no. Oh, oh he's locked oh, overhead belly to belly suplex. The suplex master from Chroma City, New York. He can do him out of anywhere. Belly to belly, a quarter way across the ring. This is it, too. It's oh no. It is not over. It is not over. Count of two only, and Jose Valdez looks like when Peter Griffin falls down. He looks like <laughs> arm trapped underneath him. He doesn't know where he is. Apollo Stone, look, we're gonna go too straight. We're gonna start off 2016 with a bang. Apollo Stone knows what he's gonna do next, but does Jose Valdez have any idea? Apollo Stone, what's he got? Oh, this again. Oh, coming back. Oh, Stone Cutter, Stone Cutter, it's over. Hit it perfectly. That's it. Apollo, come on. Valdez kicked down. Valdez kicked down on two and nine tenths. That was incredible. A Stone Cutter for the ages. A gif, if you will. And Valdez kicked out. Apollo Stone now. Apollo Stone may have spent himself. He's still down on one knee. I want to talk more about Apollo Stone's new tattoos. One of his new tattoos says King on his knuckles. Is he the king of New York? Is he going to win this match? Is he going to rock you? Send it up one more time. Apollo Stone in. No, a counter. Valdez. Oh, stuffed him with the impersonator DDT. Valdez swatted away a second and killing Stone Cutter. Brought him in for the impersonator DDT. And Stone, Stone doesn't know where he is, but he's getting back up. Valdez now. We're going to set something up. What's it going to be? Oh, kicked out the knee. Send it up. Oh, oil spill. Oil spill with authority. Stone, face first, no protection. What's Valdez doing? Referee went to count. Valdez trying to set something up. Is he going for the Cloverfield? Could this be the Cloverfield, a submission move? Valdez looking to turn him over. Valdez gonna turn him over, but can he? Oh, oh, one, two, it's over. Figure four pin does it. Figure four pin, Jose Valdez, electric pin, and he beat the man at Battle for the Beast.